Yeah. How did the memory exercise go? Well, to hear it from Adler, it's working. Bell remembered finding that encrypted intel in Vietnam and has almost finished decoding it. Anything useful in there? Some names, apparently. Possible leads. Park is trying to connect the dots. We don't have much time. Does the team know about our mishap in Berlin yet? No, but if it's connected to one of those names from Bell, they'll find out soon enough. You won't let that happen, Hudson. Don't say anything more than necessary. That's never been a problem for me. We finished analyzing the names Bell acquired at Tanang. One in particular stands out. Anton Volkov. He's a Russian arms dealer working out of East Berlin. Admittedly, his connection to Perseus comes as a surprise. We've got killer capture orders on Volkov. So if we can't get to Perseus, we'll get to his men. Close off his resources, force him out of hiding. Mason and Woods are still wrapping up business in Kiev. Which means Volkov is ours. Gear up, and we'll move out. We'll talk on the drive, Bill. Here we go. MI6 has been tracking Volkov for seven years. It is my strong preference that we attempt to capture rather than kill him. Hold that thought. He holds answers to a great many questions. Your preference has been... So listen up. An ex-CIA operative named Robert Aldrich has gone rogue. Langley believes this asshole is working with Perseus to assemble... All right. I'll let Mason and Woods know that we're ready. They'll be handling this one. Our source tells us that Aldrich is about to move south across Colorado and into northern New Mexico. That's where we'll intercept his convoy. We can't let a former CIA operative run a Perseus spy factory. Let's put this asshole six feet under. I can't believe Aldris betrayed the CIA. Betrayed the whole fucking country. Phoenix 2-4, this is Phoenix 2-1, 30 seconds out. We're up, Mason. Locked and loaded. Oh, shoot! 
Got the photo. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Taking heavy fire, wave it off. God damn it! Never mind. Run it out, circling back. Hey, they've got red. Head to cover.